Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel or hello for the first time. Here is where the float house resides in Petersburg, where our journey begins. In today's video, you'll be towing along with us 25 miles north from Petersburg, Alaska to Thomas Bay. The trip took about five and a half hours, which is summed up in this video in about 12 minutes. This is the view from our front porch with piston rudder across from us, a marine maintenance company, and the Coast Guard parallel to us. Here we go. We woke up at 5 a.m. to start the day. This video was taken at 5.20 a.m. and Dan's taking the skiff out to check Frederick Sound by the light of the moon to see if the weather is good enough to tow the house. It was so dark this morning that some of the video is a little bit fuzzy, but bear with us, it'll clear up soon. And <laughs> hey, be careful. Here we're turning the house from parallel to the dock to perpendicular to the dock, so we have a smoother transition out from the dock into the narrows, and we will be towing the house from the stern of the house to the stern of the priest point. We're off. Matt's jumping on the skiff. I'm gonna try and clear this dock right here. Bear Claw Mountain. Coast Guard. Freeze Point. We are doing a short tow as we leave the dock. We're gonna get out here in the narrows and extend the line. we did at low tide because we wanted to catch the tide going into Thomas Bay to save some time. High tide today is 1.19 p.m. Here we're passing the drive down dock, the South Harbor, the Sons of Norway, Middle Harbor, the old Ocean Beauty building, and farther north is the North Harbor.
We took off from a town at about 6.30. It is 11.30 right now and we've got probably another quarter mile till we get to the fish pens in Thomas Bay where we will be landing the float house. So probably about five, five and a half hours total, which is really good running time for towing the house. So 25 miles from Petersburg to Thomas Bay. It's absolutely gorgeous out here. Um, thank you to Jeff Erickson on the Priest Point for towing us out here. My dad, Rob Schwartz, and Matt Palisard for crewing. And my loving husband for get all this video footage and my mom who kept our voice for the day so that we could do this together and bring you guys this journey on film it's been a lot of fun I always love it this will be our eighth year rearing chump salmon in Thomas Bay we've got 14 pens set up with 28 million chum salmon in them we've got a crew watch them right now while we're towing the house out uh, Dan's been living on a boat the last Two and a half weeks. I'm gonna run back to town today and Dan's gonna spend the next two days getting the house set up with dad and then we'll run in and get the boys on Monday and be out here as a family. Little Luna is excited to be back. It's gonna be a spring full of adventure, so stay tuned. a time lapse from the back of the float house landing the float house at the fish pens in Thomas Bay. Um, I had both lines on the float house from the bow and the stern that I gave to Dan in the skiff and he brought them from the skiff to the pens and Matt and Otis grabbed them and pulled the float house nice and cozy right up to the fish pens. Um, next time I'll put a GoPro on one of them so that they can film the actual float house landing. Here's a glimpse of what it looks like over in Thomas Bay with 14 fish pens and 28 million chum salmon to raise until the beginning of June. I found some footage the other day of us landing the float house in Petersburg in 2021 so that'll probably be my next video so stay tuned for that. Thank you for coming along this journey with us. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that thumbs up and subscribe button and join us for more adventures this spring. We'd love to take you along. God bless you.